eight. Number two, a YouTube channel called BD Ghost Hunter sent me this video of a cursed village in their home country of Bangladesh. They don't explain how or why it became cursed. Nobody ever talks about that. All anyone says is that it was abandoned long ago and that the survivors had to move across water to get away. Everyone knows not to cross the bridge because strange and scary things are waiting on the other side. But on this night, they want to find out what their elders won't tell them, and so they step forward. There's movement in the distance, the figure of a person in the shadows, not an animal. They approach the old building and see no one is on the roof. <laughs> the BD Ghost Hunter team bravely goes upstairs to investigate the paranormal activity, and that's when things get even more bizarre. not even Google is able to translate what they are saying, so translate this next part if possible. <laughs> I'm almost positive someone is holding the chair, but no one is there when they round the corner and it's still propped up at a weird angle. Anyway, that's weird, but when they reach the balcony, where the windows first open, they find nothing wrong with them. That's when they feel the curse grow stronger and turn around. <laughs> They follow the footsteps up the roof and find a door that's deadbolt locked on their side, meaning no one could have passed through. <laughs> Oh, 
They open a rusted door and don't find much activity at first, but that all changes soon enough. A ghost slams shut the door while they are examining the object. They dare not go any further into this village and leave knowing nothing more about the place other than the legends are real. Do you believe them? I might. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds? Because I upload 4 new scary videos every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. A ghost hunter named Jay goes exploring an infamously haunted place known as the Yellow House. The paranormal activity begins minutes into the investigation. Anyone that's residing in this house, I come in peace. You don't have to be scared of me. I'm gonna get the EMF meter out just so I know kind of what's going on around here. Oh. How you doing? Do you remember me from the other night? We're off to a good start. Well, I will keep an eye on this as we walk around. Keep stepping on crap though. Man, I can feel people just walking around behind me. This is so, so much more active than it was the other night. I swear I keep hearing somebody moving around. It's freaking me out. There was nobody in here when I walked around earlier. Now I have been here for a little bit. Crosses back through the kitchen. Watch the sound levels. Okay. So maybe we disproved that one. I so hear somebody else. Angry. Behind. Angry? Are you trying to make me angry? No. Notice how the ghost says the word angry just outside of a room with a bunch of holes punched in the wall. Something is in here. I swear I'm being followed. I swear something is walking around behind me, messing with me, and then going around and <sighs> Part of Jay wants to leave, but this is the best paranormal evidence he's ever gotten, so he swallows his fear and sets up one last experiment using his final piece of equipment. You know what? I actually want to try some. We were getting that stick figure in this hallway, like I was saying, or in this closet. I want to see if. The 
What was just going on for that? Look, 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 look. Thank you for making that ball go off. He is not moving at all. It's not the floor shaking from his steps. He goes back to the kitchen where he's gotten the most activity. I know you guys had to, I hope this picked that up. It sounded like somebody just tapped on the wall. Keeps wanting me to go back there, but I'm, I'm done. And if you thought that video was creepy, look what happened the month prior when he went exploring a place known only as the Haunted Doll House. It's a lot of energy in here. I feel it. I, I heard wow. somebody talk to me coming It's crazy. He sweeps the room for activity and detects the word spirit when facing the doll. Next, they get a steady indication of EMF activity on the toy. They determine the spirit is named Josh and decide to confirm their findings with a second piece of paranormal equipment. Can you light the REM pot up again? It's the green. Can you light up the blue? Light up the blue or the purple. Oh, I bet it is. That's the name I got in that room. Really? Hi, Joshua. Is that Morse code? Yeah, I don't know. Is that your friend, Josh? I've never seen one of these things go this crazy no, for this long. It's definitely, definitely. I, it's spirits of children. I can feel that Dead. already. Dead. They hold an EVP session, and while they don't pick up any distinct voices, a final creepy moment does happen. If you can't see a light, I'm going to the light. While persuading the spirit to detach itself from the doll, an orb just so happens to go past the light and into her. This spirit is either finally being released or transferring itself to a new living host. Climbers are taking on Mount Blanc, the highest mountain in all of Western Europe, stretching across both Italy and France. In other words, not exactly the kind of place where you'd want to accidentally do this. At 28 seconds.